We'd like to welcome Nicole Simons to the show. She's a therapist at Windsor Laurelwood, a place that does a lot of good work. And I thought it might be nice to remind people of some of the things you guys do there. Absolutely. So we serve the community for those who struggle with mental health and substance abuse diagnoses. We have inpatient hospitalization for adults and for kids, a detox program, and we also have our outpatient services. So, so how does that work, the outpatient services? Uh, it, you, do you do it like Zoom or telephone, or how do you do that? So a lot of our stuff is in person. We have mental health, a dual diagnosis, and a chemical dependency track for both our PHP programs and our IOP programs. Our PHP programs are five days a week, Monday through Friday, and IOP is a little less intensive, and it's three days a week. The dual diagnosis and the CD programs for IOP offer telehealth services at this time. All of our programs are facilitated by master's level therapists. Um, and we also do transportation for those in Lake County and Cuyahoga County that might need help getting to us. You know, we heard about a lot of different things there. And I guess if you're not uh, associated with having one of those problems, you probably don't recognize some of those things. But a lot of things we're talking about are substance abuse. So, so how do you guys deal with substance abuse at Laurelwood? So for our outpatient, we have specialized tracks for all of our programs, and especially clients with uh, diagnosis for substance abuse. The therapists we have running those programs have chemical dependency certifications on top of their therapy license to help those guys a little more specific in their needs. So uh, things aren't complicated enough, and now we have to deal with COVID. So that, <laughs> that, that's, that's a whole nother thing going on out there. So how do you guys interface with that? So all of our clients are screened for symptoms before entering the building and we're monitoring them throughout the day. The clients and the staff are wearing masks throughout treatment and our counselors are sanitizing the group rooms um, between different groups. So the problems that you help people with being a therapist, uh, is it young people, old people? What, what, what's the range of folks that you help there? Currently for outpatient, we are serving um, adult populations with mental health and substance abuse but we are implementing our adolescent PHP program for ages 13 to 17 at the end of October. So, so people are seeing this and some people are like, you know, this is one of those things where you sort of have to make a decision to get in touch with you. And one of the things you have to know is like where to find you, how do I do it? So how many locations do you have or where are you located? We are located on Euclid Avenue in Willoughby. So do you have a Facebook page or a website people can go to? We do. We have WindsorLaurelwood.com for our website, and we also have our Facebook page, Windsor Laurelwood. Okay. And, you know, I was sitting here listening to all these different things. I mean, I'm, I'm learning a lot about the different patients and such. And how does a person figure out or decide or feel like they should, they should be getting in touch with Windsor Laurelwood? What are some of the symptoms? So there are a bunch of different symptoms out there. Even if you're just struggling with day-to-day -day life, can't seem to manage, maybe have some burnout going on. Um, best thing to do is call up at Windsor Laurelwood at 1-800-GET-HOPE for more information about our inpatient and outpatient programs. And you can actually schedule a free assessment with our intake department. Okay, that sounds terrific. It's Windsor Laurelwood and uh, Nicole Simons is a therapist there. And until just, from, just from talking to you a few minutes, you can help a lot of people out there. So we really appreciate your time. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me.